<laughs> so now you're pregnant and you're starting to gain a little weight and you're really getting concerned about if you're going to be able to fit in those jeans after you have that baby. Well, today I want to talk about weight gain in pregnancy and should you really worry about gaining too much weight, what the risks are, what the recommendations are, how much weight gain is normal, what you can do to assure that you are eating healthy. I'll tell you exactly what you need to eat in order to have a healthy diet while you're pregnant. What the average size baby is and more. Hello, mother and daddy. I'm Dr. Tanya, helping you to have a healthy pregnancy and a healthy and happy baby. Let's get started. So really, how much weight should you gain during pregnancy? Well, it's based on your body mass index, your BMI, and you can get your BMI from your doctor because every time you go to the doctor's office, they're going to calculate your BMI. Or you can use this calculator that's readily available online. It will calculate your BMI. All you need is your weight and your height. It's important to gain enough weight, but it's also important not to gain too much weight because you don't want a big baby. The average size baby is 7.5 pounds, and it could complicate your pregnancy if you gain too much weight. Now, most women don't. Even though they gain a lot of weight, they don't usually have a lot of complications with increase weight gain but it's best not to gain a whole lot of weight and what's a whole lot gaining less than the recommended amount of weight i mean you can have a small baby you'll end up with a baby too small and so and gaining too much weight you you could end up with a baby that's too big and the baby and you may need a c-section instead of having a vaginal birth so it's a balance in that now baby born too small the reason why we don't want a baby that uh to be born at a low birth weight is because the baby could end up in icu or you know need, needing to be fed to gain enough weight to go home so um, it's uh, and the baby could be at increased risk for um, illnesses as well if the baby is too small. And if a baby is born too small, the baby might experience some developmental delays. And um, usually babies catch up after a period of time if they do have some developmental delays initially. But um, actually, you know, you really want to make sure that you know how much weight you should gain. Research has shown that gaining too much weight during pregnancy could possibly cause a child to have obesity during childhood. And if you gain too much weight, you might not be able to lose the weight in a reasonable amount of time after pregnancy, which could lead to uh, being obese, which could lead to you not being able to get in your genes. So you want to be able to return to your normal, as close to your normal weight as possible, which sometimes it takes a while to get back down to your normal weight after you have the baby and you shouldn't worry about it once you have the baby as soon as it as soon as you have the baby to try to lose weight so I wouldn't worry about that at all here's a chart that tells you the amount of weight gain that's recommended according to the Center for Disease Control and it has it listed for the weight gain recommendations for women pregnant with one baby or if you have twins what your recommended amount of weight is so I wouldn't stress over it too much. But based on your BMI, these are the numbers. According to the National Vital Statistics System on birth data, 48% of women who are pregnant are above the pregnancy weight gain recommendations. And only 32% of women are within the pregnancy weight gain recommendation. So should you be really concerned about this weight and worried about it and all stressed out over? No, the answer is no, 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 no. Don't be all stressed out about it. Don't really worry about it that much. Follow the My Plate on the CDC website, including the five food of veggies a day, drink the eight to 10 glasses of water a day. And that would be your balanced meal and you'll just be fine. So if you're a doctor, you can ask them, you can ask your health care provider. And when I say doctor, I mean health care provider. And if they are not concerned about your weight gain, then you're likely to be just fine. But you can track it yourself with the tracking tool that I have in the description. So.
don't hesitate to use that, but I don't want you stressing over it. So just know your the normal recommended amount of pounds is 25.3 pounds to 35.2 pounds. And you should be gaining a pound a week after 20 weeks. And you'll just be fine. Because basically, if you drink your eight to 10 glasses of water a day, and you're eating your five fruit or veggies a day, you're not going to be really that hungry for a lot more of junk food. Try to stay away from the junk food, avoid extra salt. And if you're going to use, when you cook with salt, use the Himalayan salt, which has some minerals in it. What I want you to take away from this is the fact that you, you're going to gain weight. And that's good. But you don't want to gain too much weight and just be aware of what the normal weight gain is. And if you're a little bit over that, it's not a big deal. If you're a little bit under that, maybe you need to eat a little bit more. But usually we don't have to worry about being a little bit under the, the weight gain general. Because we usually, when we're pregnant, we eat enough to uh, for us and baby. But in the beginning, meats could cause nausea and vomiting, which nausea and vomiting is to be expected in the first trimester. But if you're not had spilling ketones in your urine, then you probably it's okay and you're not getting dehydrated. But if you're having excessive nausea and vomiting, you really want to contact your doctor about that because you don't want to have that dehydration and electrolyte imbalance. So overall, don't worry about your weight if you're a little over or you're a little under, especially in the first trimester or the first four weeks of pregnancy. And then over time, you will notice that either you will catch up or you will lag back if you're overweight or you'll catch up if you're underweight. And actually, um, the normal amount of weight gain recommended by the association, the normal weight gain that's recommended is 25 to 25.3 to 30. 5.2 pounds so you got some lead way there uh just don't overeat that's the whole thing don't eat overeat and eat healthy and you'll do just fine that's all i have for you today stay tuned to mother baby daddy where i'll tell you everything you and daddy needs to know about having a healthy pregnancy and a healthy and happy baby thanks for listening and i'll see you in the next one